What's up guys, Stacia here, also known as Body by Day. Today we're gonna to be talking about probably the most anticipated thing, what I get questioned about so much uh, throughout all my videos and Instagram and stuff like that is how to gain weight. So I'm here to explain to you um, kind of an easiest way that I can just because it can get really complicated and really in-depth because everybody's type is different. Um, but this is kind of like an overall on how to gain weight. So the number one thing you guys is diet 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 and I know that for many of us including myself as you guys may know um, fast metabolism is our like devil <laughs> we can eat as much as we can and we can't get any weight um, so let me break this down for you the only way to gain weight the only way to build muscle is to be in a caloric surplus so what does this mean it means that you have to burn less calories than what you consume so on a day-to-day -day basis we burn calories just to keep us alive and of course be working out so that is included in that too so let's say hypothetically that my calorie maintenance which is the calories that I burn on a daily basis is 2,000 calories so if I eat 2,000 calories and I burn off 2,000 calories I'm gonna stay the same weight so if I add more calories if I eat more Let's say I eat 2,125 calories. That's already 125 calories more than my maintenance level. So I'm automatically going to gain weight just by adding that many little calories on a daily basis. All right? So that really is what it is. If you guys download an app called My Fitness Pal, that would be an easy way to track your calories and your calorie intake and how much you burn and how much you're uh, eating and all that stuff. So that's a really cool app that I use myself and you can use it for if you want to lose weight as well. Um, so that really is the key. You have to find your RMR. You can Google it. I'll put a link on the description bar of the one that I use. And once you find your RMR, you just add 125 calories for women. If you're male, you can add 250 calories, okay? So remember, if you're a woman, you want to add 125 calories. If you're a man, you want to add 250 calories to your RMR. And to build good quality muscle, that should be around the range that you should stay at. Because if you go too much at a surplus, you're going to gain a lot more fat. Your goal is you want to gain muscle with a little bit of fat. It's impossible to gain no fat. You're going to gain some fat. But the goal is to gain as little as possible. So I know a lot of you guys want results as fast as you can and it's like it's not really gonna happen it's actually faster and easier to lose weight than it is to gain weight you know why because to build muscle it has to tear it has to repair to grow so it takes a while it usually takes about for women it takes about a pound a month and for males it takes about two pounds per month for the muscle to grow you're obviously still gonna gain extra pounds from water weight and from fat but the actual lean muscle is going to be about a pound for women and about two pounds for males. So it really takes time, you guys. I gained all this weight in about two years. It didn't just happen in two months. So you really have to just stay consistent and just really just think of it as a lifestyle. This is going to be a lifelong thing because if you stop working out as soon as you reach your goals, all of this is just going to disappear. So you really have to keep going at it. And to be honest, like... At first it may seem hard, it may seem like difficult because it's such so different from your regular lifestyle but this will become your new lifestyle and you're going to learn to love it. It's like not doing it will just be weird. So don't worry about it, it's going to become a habit after a while and you're going to love it and it's just going to be your lifestyle to be this way. And also a lot of people always talk to me about supplements, oh if I drink a lot of protein shakes will I gain weight? You need protein, you need fats and you need carbs. That's your macros, you need it. There's only, but depending on the person, you need certain amount of protein, some certain amount of fats, certain amount of carbs. So, drinking a bunch of protein shakes not necessarily going to make you gain weight because again, you need to be a caloric surplus. So you need to eat, eat a lot more than your calorie maintenance level. All right. So drinking a bunch of uh, protein shakes not necessarily going to make you gain weight. It's going to help build a muscle, but you're. I don't. Wouldn't kill myself trying to drink all these protein shakes. Okay. And before my workouts, I usually, I don't really take pre-workout just because I feel like I don't really need it. But what I do take is BCAAs. I particularly take the Bro Labs one. It's called Revolt. Um, this promotes lean muscle mass, preserved hard-earned muscle, improves endurance and recovery. So if you guys are having trouble with being sore, this can definitely help uh, relieve the soreness. Or so if you guys are interested in that, I have a link in the description bar for this. Check it out. So once you get your diet now. Next is exercise. So exercise, you want to be in the hypertrophy stage, which is when you're going to build muscle. So the way you do that is to stay in this range. In the 6 to 12 reps, 3 to 5 sets, 
with less than 60 seconds of rest. You don't want to really go too far from the rest because then you would just kick yourself out of that hypertrophy stage. You really want to stay in that. So really just stay focused, you know, knock them out back to back, as minimal rest as you can. If you need the rest, obviously take it, but try to stay under 60 seconds. You really want to lift heavy. You're not going to build muscle by lifting very light weights. You really want to do low reps and heavy weights. And like I said in the past videos, the way you determine your kind of heavy is if you can pick up a weight and it can be light enough, just light enough where you can finish your reps, but it's heavy enough where the last three or four reps it's going to be really, really hard for you to really pick up those weights, but you can still do them. But you really want to struggle because that's when you're challenging yourself and that's when you're really going to build those muscles everywhere where you really want them. So that really is an overall on how to gain weight. It really is your diet and heavy weight training and minimal cardio. You really want to stay stick to about 5 to 10 minutes before your weight training as a warm-up and that's pretty much about it. You don't want to do too much cardio when you're trying to gain weight. Um, make sure you stretch. You do foam rolling, especially when you're sore. Foam, foam rolling is key because it really, really, especially with me, it helps with like really the tension. And when it's tight, I can feel like I feel loose again. I can work out again. Um, so yeah, if you guys have any questions, make sure you guys comment. Uh, you can guys can email me. I have an email in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.